There's fake news. Then there's real news. Here's the real news with white Jesus. Uh, our next story, uh, Walmart announces new Black Friday plans. The new plan includes a new name for the event. The new name, you guessed it, Friday of Color. They're going with Friday of Color. That seems a little retarded. It, it, it does. Ben and Jerry's debuts ice cream honoring Colin Kaepernick. The new ice cream is on the very bottom shelf of the freezer section. So you literally have to kneel to grab the new flavor. You have to take a knee to buy Colin Kaepernick's uh, Ben and Jerry's. Hey, North Korea issues a rare apology after killing South Korean official at sea. Kim Jong-un said he's very sorry for the unsavory event. Dude, uh, North Korea needs to realize that they aren't Canada, man. You just can't kill somebody and say you're sorry. That, that's, that, that's what Canada, can, uh, can, uh, Canadians would say. That's what they would say. Alright, bro, I'm back in my car. Oh, okay, cool, you're in your car. I'm gonna smoke a little weed. Hey, dude, our next story is Trump. Anti-Trump host Rachel Maddow asks for prayers on behalf of President and First Lady. She's praying for the President? Yeah, and I never thought I'd say this, but uh, Rachel Maddow is a uh, class act. That dude's all right in my book. He's a dude. I don't know, man. People could be whatever. Man dressed as Incredible Hulk destroys Trump's Hollywood star. Um, eyewitnesses, eyewitnesses are reporting that the Incredible Hulk looked an awful lot like Hillary Clinton in Greenface. <laughs> Our top story, Florida firefighters make history as department's first all-female crew. So, if you live in Palm Beach Gardens, Florida, make sure not to start any fires because a bunch of girls are going to come and try to put it out. I don't know. I took a risk with that one. Our next story. The Oscars announce new representation and inclusion requirements for Best Picture eligibility. To meet the new requirements, in order for a film to win Best Picture, it must star a deaf, disabled, transsexual midget of color. Midget of color. Hey guys, the Pope. Who likes the Pope? Who likes the Pope? Cool Pope! 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 Anyway, guys, the Pope endorses same sex civil unions. Cool Pope. Uh, the Pope did make it clear that he was just talking about dudes. <laughs> boys, boys, and dudes. Protesters topple statue of Abraham Lincoln in Portland. Uh, but if you ask me, that's what Lincoln gets for freeing the slaves. <gasps> no, guys, you don't understand. Like, Disneyland and other theme parks face strict reopening guidelines. The most strict guideline took place at both Disney theme parks, as Donald Duck, for the first time in 86 years, has been forced to wear pants. <laughs> about time they got pants on that fucking pervert uh, a Florida man is mauled by leopard after paying for full contact experience with a black leopard <sighs> the infamous Florida man is demanding his money back but the owners of the leopard pointed out that being mauled is part of the full contact experience <laughs> well there's nothing funny about a mauling it's kind of funny. This Florida man knows no bounds. An Illinois woman uh, stabbed, strangled, and set on fire in Forest Preserve. Uh, we here at the White Jesus Show uh, wish her a speedy recovery. Hey guys, I just uh, took a quick bathroom break. I, I did video the entire thing. Uh, to see that, you'll have to join my Patreon. Our top story, host of Jeopardy, Alex Trebek, dies at 80. I'm, I'm sorry, I've just been told that I have to deliver the punchline in the form of a question. 
Uh, let me see if I can remember how Jeopardy works. Uh, the clue is, he is saddened by the passing of Alex Trebek. And the answer is, who is white Jesus? Cool Pope, cool Pope, cool Pope, cool Pope. Our next story, Oakland to settle lawsuit for ghost ship fire. Reach for comment, the ghost stated, boo. And finally, UPS allows its employees to wear their natural black hairstyles. Finally, black UPS employees can take off the blonde wigs that were issued to them when they were hired. But come on, guys. <laughs> Donald Trump participates in the annual turkey pardon. This marked Trump's fourth Thanksgiving turkey pardoning and Michael Flynn's first time dressing up in a turkey suit. I know Michael Flynn. New Orleans Swingers Convention led to 41 COVID-19 infections. Read about this and more in Duh Magazine. Shout out Norm MacDonald. Our next story, Wilton Gregory becomes the first black American cardinal for way too long. It's been a white privilege to have sex with young boys in church. Um, astronauts hold Q&A at space station. 90% of the questions were about how they poop. This just in. China planted a flag on the moon. Reach for comment. The United States of America said, Hey China, stop stealing our moves. Shout out once again, Norm MacDonald. Please, Norm MacDonald, sue me. Black bikers see racism in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina traffic plan. The first sign that the traffic plan was racist was their dead end signs. Our next story, Starbucks names investment pro Melody Hobson as board chair. And, and she's a person of color. Uh, the appointment comes as corporate America faces mounting pressure to increase diversity in the boardroom. Starbucks is also vowing to remove black coffee from their menus and replace it with coffee of color. You can also order a African Americano. Our top story, the Cleveland Indians will change their name after this baseball season. Good move, pale face. Honor the natives of this great land by taking away their baseball team? Well, I, I guess we should all get ready for the Cleveland baseball team. Like we just took away the Redskins from them. But when will we stop taking things away from the, the natives? Diverse TV holiday season includes all Asian Lifetime movie. Although the TV holiday season is more diverse than ever, White liberal girls are saying there's too many white little people and are demanding midgets of color. White girls, man. You can't never make them happy. Man with chainsaw robs McDonald's and chases workers. Damn. Donald Trump is not handling his loss well. Look at that. Not happy. Not happy. Our next story, Santa and Mrs. Claus expose kids to COVID-19 at an event. God, not at Christmas. In their defense, all the exposed kids were very naughty. Our next story, black man says trooper beat him with a flashlight. Reach for comment, the trooper stated, hey, at least I didn't shoot him. I don't even know if I should uh, put that joke in there. Our next story, a city fined for hiring too many women. In an embarrassing twist, the city had to go into his wife's purse to cover the fee. He didn't have enough money. Our next story, New York banned sale of hate symbols on state property. Bad news for Charlie's House of Swastikas. And finally, 
Fire kills 240,000 chickens at Florida Farm. Reach for comment, the lone surviving chicken was asked why he crossed the road. The chicken replied, because of the fucking fire guy. Fucking reporter? I know what you're getting at. Oh, why are you crossing the road? You're a chicken. You smell all that chicken? That was my family. Go, why don't you go do some real reporting? Because of the fucking fire. Anyway, now we know why uh, the chicken crossed the road in Florida. Man named Adolf Hitler wins election in Namibia. Promises he's an okay guy. Uh, I'd also like to point out that the actual Adolf Hitler also promised he was an okay guy. Michigan boy severely injured by explosive in Christmas ornament box. To be fair, it should be noted that the boy was on the naughty list. Japan Airlines drops ladies and gentlemen for gender neutral greetings. Japan Airlines Board of Directors arrived on a new inclusive greeting. Folks. That just seems like an odd choice for the Japanese. Folks. In Florida Man News, Florida Man punches cab driver. Shouts, I'm Rick James, bitch. Reach for comment, the infamous Florida Man was asked why he would do such a thing. He replied, because I'm Florida Man and that's what I do. I'm also Rick James, biatch. Dolly Parton released a new Christmas album this year, A Holly Dolly Christmas. Happy birthday, Jesus. I hope you like crap. This Christmas, iguanas, not snow, are falling in Florida. You know, as a uh, Floridian, we always look forward to the uh, seasonal iguana fall. Man, I have great memories of iguana fights and I'd build iguana men with my friends our next story Michael Jackson's Neverland Ranch sold to billionaire the billionaire has stated that the ranch is perfect for him and he's excited to move in and start sleeping with young boys you, you guys knew that Michael Jackson was a uh, homosexual pedophile right that, that's why that's funny. Virginia residents warned to stay away from hairy, venomous caterpillars. Read all about this and more in Duh Magazine. Louisiana priests caught having sex with two dominatrices on church altar. Reach for comment, the priest stated, Well, of course I did it at the altar in the church. My wife was home. I'm a priest.